A kayaking fisherman trying to catch southern bluefin tuna almost ended up in the water with a shark in a viral video. Ten kilometres offshore from Waiho Bay in the eastern Bay of Plenty, Greg Potter got caught in the middle of a standoff between a seal and a hungry mako. Alice Wilkins reports. It looks like a National Geographic doco or maybe the latest Jaws sequel, but this encounter was real. So I've got a juvenile great white shark chasing a uh, seal out here. This is unreal. And Greg Potter witnessed it all firsthand while fishing for southern bluefin tuna out of Waiho Bay. Thinking it was tuna, I went to approach it and yeah, then I realised this was no tuna. It was a huge shark chasing a seal. Back to his day job today, Greg is way out on the water in his kayak most weekends. He started sharing his fishing videos online three years ago, but this latest adventure was very different. When the seal tried to use his kayak for cover, the shark almost put Greg in the water as it lunged at its prey. It was a pretty strong nudge. Um, and that knocked me a bit, but it was the second one which really, really uh, caused some havoc. Um, that shark must have been coming full force at the underside of the kayak, and, and uh, while it doesn't show it on the camera, I was tipping right out the side of the kayak. Initially identifying it as a baby great white, Greg now thinks it was a mako, and experts agree. The characteristics of makos is they do have a tendency to jump vertical, um, chasing bait or prey. Um, we quite often see that out in the water. While Greg doesn't know if the seal got away, he's grateful he did and he hasn't been deterred at all. Oh, here they come. I kept fishing straight away after the shark left. Um, and then I went back and caught it with some mates and then we went back out for a dive just off the coast there. The standout clip might just be his greatest catch yet. Alice Wilkins, News Hub.